so today I'm here to give you my review of the Julie Caboose Ultralight Graphite Stroller. So the rest of this review is going to be me behind the camera. Mark's going to be helping me showing it off. So I'm going to pin to that right now and I will see you afterwards. Please excuse any background noise you may hear. Remy is going to be joining us for this review. But I'm going to show you guys the features about the stroller first and then later I will go into our personal experience and thoughts and opinions on it. So the stroller retails for around $249.99, but I have seen it on sale on Amazon for $206. I'll have a link down below for that. It does come in five different colors. Mine is obviously in black. It does have an aluminum frame. Without the accessories, it weighs 19.9 pounds. With the accessories, it weighs 23.6 pounds. So this stroller can be a single or double stroller. Right now we have it as more of a sit and stand stroller that has the front seat and then it also does have a rear seat in the back and also a place for a toddler to stand at. With this stroller you also get some accessories there's the parent organizer which is up top by the handlebar you can fit a lot in it there also is a car seat adapter it is compatible with 28 different car seats it's pretty easy to install as you can see mark's just clipping it right on it has two little clips on either side and you just push it right on it also does come with a snack tray, which is just like the car seat adapter. You just click it in on either side, and you also do use those little snaps on either side to remove it as well. So there are three different recline options available. There's one that's almost completely flat, but still has a little bit of a recline. Then there's sitting all the way up, and then there's one in between those two. So this stroller does offer a very large and customizable canopy, as you can see in the front. It has a ton of different options. You can push it as far frontwards or backwards as you want. And it also does have a second little section, which Mark is popping out just right now. So you can include that. You can pop it inwards and not have it at all. It really is just up to you. It also offers the rear canopy and this is an option because you can have it on or you cannot and it's just a simple zipper that attaches it to the underside of the back side of the front canopy. I like that it's stretchy because Sophie likes to play with it and pull on it so it does have a little bit of give but I think it's a really cool option and we use it quite a bit. So as you can see down below, it does have a very roomy basket. It is a little tricky when both kids are sitting down. That's why I wish it had zippers or something on the side to easily access it. But I mean, it is a very generous basket. As for the suggested age for the seats, it does have the car seat adapter. So the front seat could technically be used from birth because you'd have your car seat you pop it in the stroller but the seat itself is recommended for three months and up and then the rear is for two and a half years old i totally forgot to mention that there's actually a harness on that back seat so you can clip your kids in and they are going to be safe as for the max weight and height for the seats it is 45 pounds in the front and 40 inches and then in the rear it is 45 pounds and 44 inches it also does offer a rear parking brake with lockable front wheels and four-wheel suspension which I will say is really good we have used this stroller on some really rough terrain and it did a pretty good job the one thing that I love about this stroller is it really does have a compact fold that was something we struggled with a lot when it came to our double strollers we were experiencing these big bulky strollers that just didn't seem to like compactly fit in our car because we don't have a ton of space with the Subaru Legacy but this thing folds super super nicely So as you can see, it is pretty slim for a double stroller and it fits beautifully in our Subaru Legacy and Mark's just going to go ahead and unfold it for you guys, but it's really not that hard to fold up. I can do it all by myself and I love that it's not too heavy and it's just really simple. So this is what the stroller looks like with the rear seat that's available separately for purchase. You can find it on Amazon for around $50. I will also have a link to it below and it comes in seven different colors. So as for our personal experience with the stroller, like I said, I really love the size. It's not big and bulky. It's something that I can totally manage all by myself with both kids and I absolutely love that. I like the versatility of this stroller. The fact that it can be a single stroller, that it can be a double stroller, that it can be a sit and stand, that there's just so many different options. The fact that the accessories 
accessories are included with this stroller makes all the difference to me. I was so shocked as a new parent stroller shopping to find that you buy the basic frame of a stroller, but if you want a snack tray or if you want this or if you want that, you have to pay extra for it. That just has never made sense to me. So I love the fact that Juvie includes that. And kind of going into my next point, I love the price point. You're getting a sit and stand stroller or a double stroller or you know, whatever you really want it to be with all the accessories for around $200, $250. That is a steal to me, especially considering that it's a well-made stroller. This isn't a piece of junk. It's not plastic. It's not going to break after just a couple of uses. Like I said, we've used this on some really tough terrain. Whether I'm walking in a mall or I'm walking on a gravel road, this thing can handle it. So I would say one of the biggest things I look for in a stroller besides size and ease of use is the canopy. I really, really like for my girls to be covered up, especially if they're younger babies, like under six months when it's not really recommended to use sunscreen yet. Obviously you need that shade to keep them out. I love that front canopy. I can't say it enough. I would really recommend this to a first time mom who's maybe anticipating having more than one child because you can use it from birth. Right away you can use a car seat adapter, pop it in there, move them to the front seat whenever it's ready. And honestly, when I do not have Sophie, I'm still using the back seat for bags, for diaper bags, shopping bags, you name it. I can put whatever I want back there. So it's still can be a single stroller and then once you have a second kid voila you have your double stroller the lockable wheels come in handy when you are on rough terrain like i said i've had it in gravel roads as i'm sure i've already shown you guys and locking those front wheels really does make a difference to better navigate through that kind of stuff all in all, I love this stroller. When we first got it, I wasn't really sure how often we would be using it because I've heard kind of so-so things on sit and stand strollers. Some people love them, some people don't. So I really wasn't sure where we were gonna fall on that spectrum, but we absolutely love this. The fact that there's a second seat available for purchase, if we need Sophie to be contained, if we're going to, you know, like the mall where I don't really want her to be easily removed from the stroller, I can pop that in, it's no big deal. But if we're going somewhere like the zoo where Sophie is constantly getting up and down and looking at things it's amazing to have the sit and stand I like that it's not bulky and I am just kind of repeating myself at this point honestly besides the one comment I had on the basket I can't find anything that I dislike about this stroller it has been amazing I highly highly recommend it if you guys have any questions or comments please leave them down below I will do my best to answer them if you guys like this video, please leave a thumbs up so I know to do more of them. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thanks for watching.